All right, I have high hopes for this round because it's got two of my favorite sets and it's got like this one. I have never opened this set before, but it has even more cards than the, than the dog set. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, guys, look, look at this. That's interesting. And they don't, oh, they don't show you the rare. Oh, there's a code. Guys, there's a code. <laughs> this is back when they give codes out, right? Is this right? Oh, here's a code, guys. Play, no, it's probably like a dumb code. Oh, this is Ravnica. Um, what is this? It's not, is it a blue Ravnica? It's just like a different, like, is it a yellow Ravnica? Do you guys remember? Okay, Celestia, Celestia. Oh, the rare's not in the front like the other card. Oh, cats. That cat's probably worth some money. Cats are worth money. Okay, it's it's basically the same. Oh, dogs. Oh, okay. It's like a cat and dog thing. Okay, we, we've hit the uh, uncommons. Again, retail, we're trying to hit $29.99. Can we do it? Probably not. Uh, my cost is eighteen sixty, with tax, with uh, ship, with tax, and that, there's no shipping. I picked them up in person. Okay. Oh, I'm not liking this. Where's the? Where's the? How many rares do we get? We get one rare. Oh, night of autumn! Oh, baby! This is a very, very cool card. If you guys don't remember, Night of Autumn, I'm her biggest fan. Autumn Buccelli, the number, the non-binary Magic the Gathering player who revolutionized the MPL. You guys know how many videos I've made about Knights of Autumn. So, okay, I can go on a massive tangent right now. Holy moly, oh man. So I got both the art card, Faithless Looting, and this card. I, I think Wizard of the Coast trying to send me a signal here. Okay, so Autumn Buccelli was a um, she, he, they, him, he, they, they, them, non-binary used to be a guy and then they transitioned, uh, into a non-binary and Wizard of the Coast, he was on Forbes magazine. So he was the magic, the first mythic champion. So she was a special invite because he was special and she won the first mythic uh, championship. And then from there, that point on, they made the whole, they built the whole NPL around her. They spent a hundred million. This is a hundred million dollar card. And then, so her name was Autumn Bruccelli. She now has like, she changed the name of her Twitch, Twitch and so on. I mean, they ruined Magic the Gathering. They, them ruined Magic the Gathering, in my opinion, because of the NPL. It's not just her. There's Reed Duke. I could, I can list them all, right? Huey Jensen. None of, nobody wanted to watch the product because the product was so stupid. Oh, uh, here, <laughs> I think this is the first scary dab we saw in a while. They, they got to tab up the Commander Legends, you know? The, oh, man, I can go on. I have made so many videos about uh, the Knights of Autumn. So the Knights of Autumn are her, like, protectors, right? So if you say anything bad about Autumn, they would come and, like, go for your job and beat you up. Not, not, uh, oh, Mana Gate. Not uh, physically, but in their mind. They would say bad things about you. That card is, I mean, what? What, what? Like, what is this? Wait, what set, what is this? Is this a, a set or what? God, I wish they gave me like a good one. I think this is set. Oh, Bliss call. oh, Bliss Caller, is this set? Bliss Caller and Manor Gate. Okay, that was very, oh, that wasn't set, that was draft. Okay, that was very underwhelming. And I did not appreciate the double faceless one. Yeah, but back to that. So the Knights of Autumn was this group of social justice warriors. And if you said anything bad about Autumn, they would just say, oh, you're transphobic. You're non bi Oh, and Autumn was the one who canceled Teresa Newsom, my favorite artist. So there you go. A lot of, you know, I, I mean, there you go. Oh, is there sec no, no security tab? Oh, there is a security tab. Oh, they're, maybe they're just hiding it better in these older packs. All right, Knight of I could go on and on about the Knights of Autumn. My God, I think Magic of the Gathering is telling me to quit the game, guys. <laughs> Knights of Knights of Autumn, holy moly! Just 
Guys, you have no idea how funny that is to me. Wait, why is this a rare? Why, why do we go back to comments? Where's the effing rare? Uh, what? <laughs> what the hell is that? Treasure Vault. Mm, that card might be more valuable. People love treasure. They love treasure. I, I've noticed something that treasure cards are quite valuable nowadays. That might be valuable. A land that can generate treasure? Like, that, that might be valuable. I don't know. Oh, is this? No, come on. Also, I've noticed they don't have any Kamigawa. I was expecting a lot of Kamigawa packs, but they didn't have any. So that was kind of weird. Just letting you guys know. I don't know what that means. I, I do like Kamigawa packs. I don't know if it's... Ooh, what is this? What is this? The number of permanents you control that are spirits and or chant. Oh, God, yeah, I don't like it. That was not as good as I thought it was. Holy moly, I thought this was like a Philia card. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Look at that. Enchanted creature, it has flying lifelink. Oh, wow, that's pretty cool. This is a really cool card, you know, I, I, I like it. It's aesthetically pleasing to me. All right, this is probably our worst opening, but we, I mean, what we got a $100 million card, guys. This card cost Wizard of the Coast $100 million to print. The Knights of Autumn. They would cancel you like you were like you were trash. Because to them, you were trash. They're Knights of Autumn. Bruchelli. Oh, Ink Summoning. I remember this card. This card was I played a lot. Oh, I remember this card. Oh, wow. What was this? What was this called? What was... Oh, they're called Lessons. Lessons. Oh, Pop Quiz. The Lessons were just terrible cards. Oh, okay, what happened here? Dramatic finale. Okay, that's that doesn't look great. Ley line invocation. Okay, wow, what, what the hell was that? That was not cool. We did not get our faithless little man. The Knights of Autumn. Holy moly. The Knights of Autumn. I've probably made more videos about the Knights of Autumn than any other topic during that time period. And how they would just cancel people. One, one Night of Autumn. Ooh. What is this? It's called a doppelganger. I've never seen this card before. Mm-hmm. What is this? Okay. Okay. Ask questions later, right? Ask questions later. You guys are not here to see me look at. Oh, Cliff Gate, take it. Oh, Heap Gate, take it. Lulu. Lulu is uh, how Luca Dantic. So I, whenever I see Lulu, I think Luca. Oh, this one is a. What the hell? Unknown. Wow, that was, wow, reality hemorrhage. Wow, that was, <laughs> wow, that, that was, uh, was fucking something, man. All right, that was probably our worst open, but we got the $1 million card. No one can say we did not get the $1 million card, because we did. The card cost a $1 million for Wizard of Coast to reproduce, guys. It's, uh, <laughs> we lost a lot of money. All right, next time, let's do Strixhaven. New Campana, Baldur's Gate. We'll do a jump start. I think jump start was kind of fun. We'll do a. Uh, what other packs do we have? Dominaria? Big, big hitter, Dominaria. And we'll do a. Uh, do we already do jump start? We'll do Commander Legends? No, we'll do this. No, we'll do another Midnight Hunt. <laughs> Why not? You know, Midnight Hunt, they got, they got these uh, booster protectors because they're so valuable.